guilty of the crime of attempted murder in the first degree, guilty of the crime of murder in the first degree, guilty of the crime of arson in the first degree. Guilty. A jury has convicted Christopher Montford for the murder of a Seattle police officer. The judge took just 15 minutes to read the jury's verdicts about three hours ago. Cairo 7's Jeff Du Bois was in the courthouse when Montford was found guilty. Jeff? Yeah, Maria, there wasn't much outward emotion or reaction when the verdicts were read in the courtroom, but afterward, for the first time, we heard an apology of sorts from Christopher Montford. Montford, any reaction to the guilty verdict? Christopher Monfort had no comment when he first left the courtroom, but as reporters followed him down the hallway, the newly convicted killer did say, I'm sorry for the family's loss and the mother and the children. Just minutes before, we the jury find the defendant, Christopher Monfort, guilty of the crime of murder in the first degree as charged. Guilty on four of the five charges against him for the 2009 murder, including aggravated murder, which carries the possibility of the death penalty. Personally, I didn't think I'd feel this kind of emotion. That I, I felt sitting in there when the, when the verdicts were read, and it's just a relief. Ron Smith, the president of the Seattle Police Guild, spoke after the verdict. Five and a half years after the killing, he thanked the jury on behalf of every Seattle police officer. The wheels of justice move slowly, as as some people say, and um, it doesn't matter how long it takes. Uh, justice delayed is justice denied, and today we got justice. Prosecutors say Monfort was hunting police officers the night he shot and killed Brenton. The murdered officer's family hugged outside the courtroom, then left quickly without talking to reporters. I can only imagine what this has been like for five and a half years, losing their, their son, their brother. I, I can't imagine what that's like. Monfort's family also left the courtroom without comment. The penalty phase of the trial will begin a week from Tuesday and is expected to last several weeks. Notably missing from the courtroom today was Officer Britt Kelly, who was in the car when Officer Brenton was shot and killed in 2009. Her testimony during the trial likely paid, played a key role in today's guilty verdicts. Uh, coming up at 12:30, hear what the president of the Seattle Police Guild had to say about Monfort's insanity defense. Reporting live downtown, Jeff DeBoyce, Cairo 7 Eyewitness News.